What's up, everybody? Richard back today with another reaction video. Today, we're doing something a little bit different from what I normally check out. You know, here on this channel, we we typically check out, you know, Metalcore, Deathcore, Pisscore. But today, we're checking out Kardashev. Uh, and actually, the vocalist of the band, uh, Mark, he's actually the uh, the guy who runs the Cardavox Academy uh, YouTube channel where he does reactions as well. I'm sure you've seen him. The guy is a, a, a vocal savant. Um, and uh, it's really cool to see... The teacher in action. So let's check out uh, Kardashev's new track here, Compost Grave Song. Here we go. Hey. Same microphone, SM7B, okay. Well, he's getting into it. Are we have the same headphones too. What? I love like the ambient effect on that. Almost uh Viking-ish. That dude's got some moves. Look at him. He's dancing in the club. All right. I love the contrast and the, the kicks. It's such a melancholic tone overall. the slow burning riff man it's almost like the screams almost remind me of like a mana mark Baseline thrown in there. You got. You got to add that. Camera out of focus. I love such a like a soulful singing voice underneath of you have like the goblin, you know, like those types of vocals. I, I think that's a really, uh, really cool contrast. That was definitely the lowest he's gone all song. There, there we go. Put him in his mouth. Feeling it, man. Oh, that's it.
All right. So that was Kardashev Compost Grave Song. So, man, there's... Uh, there's, there's quite a bit to talk about here. So, uh, I'll start with the vocals. Um, obviously Mark is, is fantastic. Uh, there was so many different kind of styles in here. You had like, I think like a couple different, uh, tones in his, uh, like the clean singing. You also had like those like kind of goblin-y black metal vocals, uh, both prominent and then also kind of acting as a layer underneath, uh, um, like the second style of clean that he did. Um, I thought it was cool seeing him expand his mouth out. That was really cool. Uh, for the majority of the song, like we didn't hear him go super low until close to the end there, but it was cool to like, he kind of had like a more of like a mid, almost like it almost kind of reminded me of like a Mon Marth. And again, I haven't listened to a Mon Marth in a while, so I could be totally off base with that, that comp, but that's kind of what it reminded me of almost like kind of Viking ish. Um, I will say, like, for me, I'm definitely a more vocally charged person in a song. So this one here, obviously, the vocals were uh, obviously, you know, a focal point, but they were kind of a little bit, um, and I, obviously it was assisted in, like, how it wasn't as prominent because of the ambient effect that was kind of over the vocals there. But it kind of acted as, like, another part of the, the music in terms of it was just kind of fused in. So it wasn't um, like, you know, like a traditional uh, kind of track where it's like the vocals are on top of the mix. It was kind of all a little bit more blended together. But what I thought was cool is you got so many contrasts in this song, whether it was the vocal performance from Mark, like I said, with the cleans and like that more black metal goblin-y sound or just, just the instrumentation where it was just kind of more spacey in terms of like the guitar work. But then you had the the the, the just going kick drums underneath as well. So lots of really interesting contrasts here. Um, I love, and I love that main riff too. Cause again, they're, they're, I, I think part of it for me when it comes to hooks and songs like this is like, I didn't really find a hook necessarily like vocally. Um, and I think part of that for me could be just needing to adjust to that ambient effect on the vocals. But to me, like that main riff, the dude, kind of just that more slow burn type of riff was a really cool hook for me. And I'm glad that they went back to that numerous times, but definitely an interesting track. Definitely something that I don't check out typically here, but uh, let's, let's go add that. Let's go find Kardashev. I was looking at them earlier. So here we go. Kardashev compost grave song put that on the playlist there i thought uh, i thought it was i thought it was really well executed um by kardashev and uh by mark and by everyone else involved but with that guys go check me on social media check my patreon my twitch my merch my playlist where that you just saw me add the song to um discord uh, all that stuff all those links are down below and until the next one peace